What were we talking about, Nicole? Faraday cages and electricity? Man, hey, Tony, can you turn down this radio? Uh, oh, how do you do that? That's amazing. How did he do that? Well, what he did was he put a metal, a metal box around the radio. So what this is, and this is what's called a Faraday cage. And it prevents external electric fields from getting inside, and therefore it prevents um, the signal from getting to the antenna. So how does it do that? Well, let's say, for example, you have your external electric field pointing like this. Well, literally, the charged particles in the metal move around. So, for example, the positives would all line up on this side, and the negatives all on this side. And because you have now positives here and negatives there, you get an electric field that points this way. And that cancels out this electric field from the outside, and therefore you get nothing going on, and you get a zero electric field inside. And if this electric field increases, well then, more electrons will flow to this side, making this side more negative, this side more positive, and you get an increase on the Faraday cage, which then cancels out the increase on this electric field. So, that's the rule. Faraday cage, made of metal, zero electric field inside. Thanks, Tony.